Hey, what's up? This is Steve USS Cunningham, two-time cruiserweight world champion. And we're checking in with Lady Chan. Shout out. In the building. Hey guys, hey guys, well, 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 well. The controversy is in the Buddhism. It's a controversial Buddhism. So, they say what happens in sparring stays in sparring. I mean, it doesn't always. And um, there was rumours, obviously, of Tyson Fury being dropped in sparring by Jai Opatia, the cruiserweight, which is Tyson Fury's on history, in history, on record, his kryptonite. Um, remember, he got dropped by my pal Steve Cunningham. Um, um, he um, he's so he's been dropped a few times. He was dropped by um, Pycheck. Um, he's a smaller man, but most people are smaller men than Tyson Fury. But he was a smaller man anyway. Um, and so this rumor was floating around, and you know, just dismissed it until. This happened. Stand by. Hearing rumours. I'm hearing rumours of what's happening. In Come on and give me it. What is it? I'm hearing he's getting turned over. Really? In the gym. Yeah. So this thing about appetite and people like that, when he's in the gym, I mean, he got he got shown his ass. You, you sure? Got, uh, yeah, man. That's so what it's I'm not hearing. a rumour. <laughs> I'm hearing these things. Wow. And I'm thinking, has he taken his eye off the ball or has time caught up on him? And so, so in, in regards to his last fight, I put that down to him disrespecting the man that was in front of him. And, 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 and I said, look, if you're to believe that he had the best training camp, his legs have gone. Mm. And, and, so, so, and, if I, and if I've got it wrong, his legs have gone. And I'd expect Tyson Fury to beat Alexander Usyk. But the Tyson Fury that boxed and gone in his last fight gets knocked out. Mm. If, that, if that Tyson Fury turns up, he's done. It's over. Johnny, as you can see, Johnny Nelson had sat down and he was in place for Simon Jordan on, uh, with Spencer Oliver on the their usual show, and Johnny Nelson uh, was the replacement uh, for Simon Jordan. Um, listen, Johnny Nelson was very adamant. That's a short clip, but I actually saw the whole hour show, and Johnny Nelson was very adamant that his sources stated that Tyson Fury did get dropped. He was dropped. By Jai Opatia. Now listen, does it make sense? Yes, it does. That that why the reason why Jai Opatia was back home. Um, you've you've flown across the world coming from Australia to um the UK and you sparred five rounds and been sent home. Now, the only reason why fighters get sent home from sparring is usually they've come, turned up to sparring, they've turned over the person that they're sparring, and they wasn't really supposed to turn over the person that they're sparring. Now, Tyson Fury's camp is saying that it's because um, he is orthodox and needs Southpaw sparring. But you knew Jaya Pattaya is an orthodox fighter. So why would you spend that money and make him travel all that way, knowing that he's an orthodox fighter, <clears throat> for five rounds to send him back? Doesn't make any sense. And if it don't make any sense, that means it's not the truth. That means the lies are in the booties. So if you want two southpaws yourself and the other guy's southpaw and you want to be a southpaw, why is that? You coming out of southpaw, we know Tyson Fury can kind of switch hit. Um, can he conduct that whole Usyk fight as a southpaw? Well, I don't know. That's going to be a bit of a challenge. <clears throat> it's something he has fought <clears throat> in a fight. I forget with who, but I know at least one fight he has fought the whole fight in southpaw in a southpaw stance. But listen, that wasn't against Alexander Usyk, the elite southpaw stancer um so it leads me to believe with johnny nelson obviously having links and um sources in uh in the um <clears throat> excuse me in the business and how adamant he was i actually 
believe that Tyson Fury did get dropped because two plus two only makes four. It does, doesn't it? You just wouldn't send for someone that isn't your specifications or specifications, if that's the right way to pronounce. Um, if he doesn't feel, feel the right criteria, you wouldn't. It's not like he's just round the corner. You know Gile Pattaya is not Southpaw, but what you wanted was someone that was a cruiserweight, a natural cruiserweight. You wanted a mover. <clears throat> you wanted a smaller man to see how that would fare. But what happened is that smaller man was Gile Pattaya, who you should know turns people over. And that's, like I said, that's Tyson Fury's kryptonite. So it just makes sense that Jaya Patai came round, turned him over. Johnny Nelson exposed it and was very adamant, double, triple, quadrupled down in that Spencer um, Oliver team up. And they sent Jaya Patai home. I've spoken to boxers that have said, if you go over uh, and you're hired as the sparring partner and you make the opponent or, or the person that's hired you, look foolish in any type of way shape form or fashion you you sent you, you sent you you sent packing um so a lot of sparring partners abide by the rules of exactly don't try and push too much unless being told and even then they can make it a soft touch because they want that payday they want their pay packet so they don't want to be sent home and um you know almost like disciplined and they're supposed to be there for a hundred rounds, or they're supposed to be there for fifty rounds, and they've only been there for 50, five rounds. Doesn't make sense. So Tyson Fury, according to Johnny Nelson, you got dropped in sparring, and then we had this as well. You know, you had you, you had to have the cheerleader. I mean, he, I don't expect him to actually tell the truth because it's his copadre, his his, his uh, life coach, his mentor, his brother. Um, you know, so stand by. Who? Tyson. Tyson. <laughs> yeah. um, sparring is sparring. Yeah. But a lot of people will make uh, make up stories, mm -hmm. you know. Um, no one really knows what happened in sparring. Only Tyson's team know. Mm -hmm. And only Jaya Pattaya knows. You know? And I, I think he flew back home because he's got sparring that he wanted to do back home. Um, and Tyson is sparring who he's sparring. Mm -hmm. But there's uh, only they would know what happened. Mm -hmm. And only they have the proof. No one else knows. So there's, I think all of these are just stories. Mm -hmm. And uh, just everyone who thinks they know what happened, but no one knows. It's sparring this week, and that got leaked or whatever. Does it? Would I don't want to go online because I know Tyson never got dropped. Yeah. And I want to go online and say, "Hey guys, he did, but I don't want to be a part of it. I just want to yeah. save my energy for my fight." Yeah. And um, as long as Tyson knows what happened, as long as Jai knows what happened, yeah. and they've gone their separate ways and yeah. doing their own training, but just a lot of people's comments online, um, just they don't know. <laughs> He said nobody knows what happened, only giant Tyson Fury. But then he said he knew. Um, and they'd gone their separate ways because Jai had his own fight to get uh, ready for. Yeah, but he always had his own fight to get ready for. So why did you fly him all the way out from Australia for five rounds? If you already knew, obviously, he was already in that on that card to get ready for. Yeah. You can see Joseph Charlie de Parker. Kept shh, dumb mate. Um, I know he didn't get dropped in sparring. Okay, well, I mean, is there a shame in any game of you getting dropped in sparring? No, but it is when it's against the cruiserweight and you keep stating that, you know, everybody that you, you're the best thing since a Venera and Eon and, you know, and um, no middleweights and cruiserweights can mess you up, even though you already had that, said that Steve Cunningham at that time was one of your toughest fights. So, I mean, there's no shame in it unless you are acting like you're above and beyond the, these things happening to you. So that's why I think it's making the the rounds, should we say. And uh, yeah, Tyson Fury, you got dropped in spot. Anyway, I'm gone. Hey, girl, it's Leah Dishan, nonetheless, come box with Shan. Gyan, yeah, the cruiserweight dropped you and your soul left the boot in. Gyan!